Example 2.12 or 3.12 for both textbooks. For details, please see the description below. In this example, we have a room which is initially at the outdoor temperature of 25 Celsius. Then a large fan which consumes 200 watts of electricity is turned on. The heat transfer rate between the room and the outdoor is given by the equation of Q dot is equal to U times A times Ti minus T naught, where U is the overall heat transfer coefficient, A is the exposed surface area of the room, and Ti and T naught are the indoor and outdoor temperatures, respectively. In this problem, we need to determine the indoor air temperature when the steady operations are established. That is the list of the known values and what we need to find in the problem. And we are going to assume in this problem that we're going to neglect the heat transfer through the floor. And we are also not having any other type of energy interactions in the problem. In this example, we need to start with a balance of energy. Notice that in this problem, the information that is provided is in terms of power, um, heat rate, Therefore, when we write the energy balance, we're going to write it in terms of rate of energies uh, to make it easier. Therefore, what we write is the first part is the rate of energy transfer, which means that we have the rate of energy going in minus the rate of energy leaving. And that is equal to the rate of change of energy in the system. And once again, this is the rate of change of how the energy changes in terms of kinetic energy, potential energy, internal energy. However, since this problem is um, steady, we are going to take this value to be equal to zero. Therefore, the amount of rate of energy um, going in has to be equal to the rate of energy leaving the system. And then in this particular case, the amount of energy going in is the amount of power provided by the fan. And the amount of energy leaving the system is the amount of heat transfer from the room to the outside. So then the amount of energy going in, we have it to be uh, 200 watts. And the amount of energy leaving is Q dot, which is written to be U times A. Ti minus T naught. And then what we're looking for is the value of Ti, which is the amount of energy inside. Then we solve this equation. This is Ti is going to be equal to um, the amount of um, 200 watts divided by U by A plus the amount of uh, T naught. We substitute the value, so Ti is equal to 200 watts. The value of U is given to be 6 watts per meter square Celsius. And the value of A is equal to 30 meters square. And the value of the outside temperature is equal to 25 Celsius. We do a little bit of math, and we find that the temperature inside is equal to 26.1, I'm um, sorry, 0.11 Celsius. Now notice that this temperature in the inside is higher than the outside and simply means that the amount of electrical power going in is higher than the amount of heat being lost into the system. 